Hello, my name is Nicholas Chantre, and today I'll be explaining the goal state task. To get started, let's create an activity and add one goal state task. The goal state task asks a student to transform an initial expression into a given equivalent goal expression. For example, let's ask our students to transform the following initial expression into the following goal expression. You'll notice that the goal state task is providing students with the answer, which is quite different from the traditional simplify or solve for approach. This is because the goal state task shifts the focus from the answer to the process of getting there as the thing we are more interested in. This approach may take some getting used to, but we have found it to be a powerful tool in improving students' flexibility, fluency, and conceptual understanding. Let's take a look at this task from a student's perspective by selecting the Preview option. This goal state task is introducing the concept of order of operations. Notice how graspable math gives immediate feedback when the student violates the order of operations. In this task, we didn't ask students to just simplify. Instead, they need to compare the expression with the goal and figure out how to make them match. In this case, that means that instead of adding, they need to commute the two numbers. Graspable math automatically gives students feedback when they solve the task and stores all of their steps so that you can review them later. You are now ready to create your own goal state tasks. Thank you.